What's up, guys? This is, uh, where did I leave myself? Senior Airman Leo. Um, today I'm doing a video response for, um, Indeed It Does. I was on his webpage and he, uh, or I'm sorry, I was on his YouTube channel and he actually has a tutorial on how to scrap, uh, how to recover gold from scrap cell phones and stuff like that. And so, what I ended up doing was, um, I tried that with sim two SIM cards and um, two of the cell phones I had. I had one Nokia Express uh, Music, which um, had a little bit of, you know, quite a few um, grams of gold, as well as the um, this old Nokia that I had. Uh, I'm sorry, an old Motorola from back in 2006. It really it's like a brick. You might be able to see other YouTube videos on, I think, like how to extract gold from cell phones it's like the the one you see in that video is red the one I have is black but it's the same uh, model um, but yeah so this is the nugget that I was able to extract from the uh, gold oh, I'm sorry the gold that I was able to extract from um, the two uh, the cell phones the thing is though this is only um, this amount is only from one and a quarter um, pieces of the cell phone so I still have three quarter or at this point it's more like one and a half so I only still have half a cell phone to go through so that'll that'll yield about I don't know maybe another gram or two um, I don't know what the purity is but uh yeah all together I got that piece that piece let's see if you can see it and tiny little guy so altogether, it's 5.8 grams. Um, gold, when I last checked it, was uh, 1703 and some change. And I'm guessing maybe this is 10 karat. Um, to be conservative, um, it's always better to you know, under, you know underestimate than um, overestimate and then be disappointed when it comes to at least precious metals. Um, it's always a pleasant little surprise. So. Yeah, this is pretty cool. It's um, this is the amount that I got, and just to let's see, just to do a quick comparison, see if I can grab a coin. Can't find it in oh, my pocket. All right. So, fiat penny. And that's not what you got. So, one of these uh, fake pennies. And that's the size. Okay, let's see. So, yeah, it's a nice little nice little nugget. Um, I roasted it. Uh, <laughs> sorry, I roasted. I melted it in. Um, to get it like this, I melted it in a furnace that I had. It was a um, 1100 degree. Um, Celsius uh, furnace, uh, 10 ounce furnace that um, you could just plug into your wall, and it melts down. Um, uh, you know, gold, copper, silver, aluminum. Actually, copper, which is really difficult to melt down. Um, I was able to melt down into ingots, into like I guess shot, like um, busted up shot. Let me show you. I was able to melt copper pennies into this this right here. It's kind of cool. Um, yeah, so in terms of experimenting, this is what that um, that yielded. Super shiny. Yeah, it's kind of cool. kind of looks like a turd, but <laughs> yeah, it's all good. And uh, this is the one my dad made. Um, this is nice looking bar. It's sterling silver and what's cool about it is there's actually a little divot on the inside not because oh crap. Um, not because um, he's trying to rip anyone off but it's just I guess when it cooled it, it dimpled. Um, I'm gonna hold on to this I'm probably gonna keep it uh, for as long as I can um, because yeah, it's sentimental my dad gave it to me I stamped it 925. Um, I don't know what the true purity is, maybe 92, um, 91%. But yeah, the dad made it. I love it. It's awesome. 
and uh, yeah so um, pretty much that is the amount that I was able to extract um, I'm gonna try out different cell phones maybe the older ones um, have more I know for sure that uh, the video that indeed it does um, the cell phone he, he used um, it was an old Samsung from like 2003-2002 um, yeah that one had a lot in it but anyways videos are roughly five and a half minutes and uh, it's 5.50 in the morning <laughs> it's exhausted I kinda stayed up all night but uh yeah um, rate, comment, subscribe. If you guys have any questions about how to scrap um, cell phones, I'm probably going to do a tutorial in the future about it. And uh, yeah, besides that, you guys uh, keep on vlogging, keep on prepping, keep on uh, uh, keep on being diligent, and I'll see you guys on the other side. See ya.